The SDSU and USD women have reigned supreme in Summit League women's hoops over the years, and this season looks to be no different, as both have identical 6-0 league records headed into their rivalry showdown this weekend in Brookings. First place in the Summit League is on the line this weekend when the USD women visit SDSU. I don't think these games are just like every other game. Um, they're, they're just as important as every other game, but the emotion and the, the feeling of it is different. One of the key challenges this weekend will be in the paint, with Hannah Shervin and Peyton Burkhardt leading the battle in the post. They help rotate, recover, as well as anybody that we play. So they make it hard to get easy baskets, and that's where I think our strength has always been. I mean, they're so long. <laughs> They've got great size, so they make it tough for you to, to score the same way because of their length and their, their toughness and their determination. Chloe Lamb and Liv Corngable's ability to score anywhere from the court has been key for the Coyotes' offense this year. You can't just say, hey, if we take away one thing that'll really slow them down because they've proven to score in multiple, multiple ways. Maya Sellen does everything for the Jacks and her versatility on both ends of the floor will present several challenges for USD. You know, she has the ability to shoot it from the arc and shoots it well. She has the ability to drive it um, from the perimeter and, you know, kick to her teammates or score it herself. Though the crowd will be limited, it'll still be the most hostile environment that USD has faced this season. We go to UMKC and there are no fans we go to Western Illinois, there are no fans. We were scheduled to come home, obviously that got canceled, you know, and so now it's an opportunity to play in that environment. If this weekend's series is anything like these rivals' past meetings, both games will be battles until the final buzzer sounds. Who can, you know, make some key shots or some key plays at the right time, and, and that's what I would assume these games will come down to as well. The Coyotes and Jacks will play both their games in Brookings this weekend. Game 1 is set to tip off Friday night at 5 with Game 2 set for the same time on Saturday.